Okay, where is this? Oh, Carl's home. Oh, miss the peaceful days, Mark. What will Carl think? Will he be happy that Marcus is not dead? And he's find his way? Alarm deactivated. Welcome home, Marcus. Oh gosh. Carl just didn't erase my data. Maybe he was waiting for Marcus? Oh gosh. Dad, I'm getting out of the hospital tomorrow. Oh. They told me that you stayed with me while I was asleep. I am. Um, I'm really sorry about everything oh, that happened. I'm gonna stop all that shit. Uh, it messes me up. It, it, it turns me into somebody I hate. Hey, I, I'd like to come by and, and, and see you tomorrow, if, if that's alright with you. I just want to let you know, I'm, I'm proud to be your son. Aww, you changed, son. Well, he's not dead. I thought I'd kill him by pushing him, but he was just unconscious. He's alive. That's a big relief. I didn't want to kill him. Is Carl okay then? Giraffe, hello. Long time no see. <sighs> Always play the piano. Okay. It's so quiet here. Oh, the painting. It's the one that I painted. He, he just loved it here. Aww. I hope I painted it as blue in the background. Red looks too bloody <laughs> to me. Aww, Carl really cares about Marcus. He's the best father. See Carl. That's the only mission. It's good to know that Carl's son is not dead. Yeah, I like the blue background. It makes Who are you? Oh. How did you get in? Makes me calm. I need to see Carl. Carl isn't seeing anyone. You need to leave. Um, I'm Marcus. Hello. Convert right away. Please. I need to see him. He's very weak. Oh, really? I'm not sure he'll be able to talk to you. That weak? I hope... Don't... Don't die, please, Carl. <sighs> oh, he became really weak. Carl. Oh, Marcus. Hey. I was hoping you'd come. I missed you so much, girl. You don't know how much I miss you. What's wrong? Lost? I'm completely lost, Carl. The whole world's falling apart around me. I try to do the right thing. I look for answers. I... Instead, I just find more doubts and more uncertainty. The world is ruled by fear, Marcus. Fear of others. Fear of the future. It's like me, too old. It's time for a damn. No, don't say that. A 
advice? Well, what should I do? Carl, they're killing my people. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but tell me, what choice do they give? Being alive is making choices between love and hate, between holding out your hand or closing it as a fist. I don't have any easy answers, Marcus. You have to accept the world as it is or fight to change it. You're my son, Marcus. Oh. Our blood isn't the same color. But I know part of me is in you. Oh, Carl. When the world falls into darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. You're one of those men. Face the abyss. But don't let it consume you. Good answer, Paul. A good advice. Please stay strong. Oh, that made me really emotional. The atmosphere looks so sad. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see her people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Thank you, Josh. Is that Simon? Those two, they are the Traces, right? Tracy. That ran away from Connor. They're still together. Our <clears throat> people are counting on you, Marcus. You're the only one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go, we'll follow you. Thank you. Oh, you look like a leader too. Uh, how can I look at them? Yeah, these two. The blue hair and the brown or red hair they were the Tracy's it's nice to see them here oh is this Kara? I thought you'd be safe staying with us 
I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Yeah, because now Kara admit that Alice is an android. Marcus. Alice is in danger too. Save our people. Okay, that's a lot of pressure. Oh. Decide Connor's fate. Oh, Connor's there. It's my fault. The humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. Of course I trust you, Connor. You're my favorite. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If oh. anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Mm. Be careful. What will Hank think about it? Okay. Yes. Should I sit down again? Oh, the footsteps. Marcus looks so... Uh, determined? Or like... supposed to go there oh north what's your system status I'm okay bullet didn't hit any by components you could have been killed trying to save me Marcus you have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. They say they don't want to take any risks with the deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps. For extermination. That's cruel. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred? Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. Thank you. I love you, Marcus. Oh. Are they sharing their emotions by that? Then maybe you can't lie about your emotion? Or maybe you can choose what kind of emotion you're going to share. Oh, if 
inform your people of your choice. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. Public opinion supportive. Demonstration. March peacefully toward the camps to pressure the authorities. Launch an assault on the camps to liberate the Andres revolution. Well, the public opinion is already supportive to us, so we can pressure the, the authorities. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them, peacefully, that we want justice. Of course, if there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? The whole fate of the Andres is all <laughs> in Marcus's hand. Night of the Soul, Marcus. Oh, oh, yeah, right. Carl's son name was Leo. Carl deteriorated after Leo was hurt and broken. Well, at least both of them are not dead. Welcome home, 43%. Play piano, only 9%. Well, this is really low. 25-14% on sacred ground spare corner 71% what what happens if you don't forgive him peaceful protests 49% there could be a lot of different outcomes. Connor, 0%. I don't think I had a chance to do something as Connor. That's weird. Okay, let's move on. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. Civilian movement will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all androids must be handed over to the authorities immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Please! Oh. Please! Madam President! Madam President! I can... Madam President! Them. Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comment? That's ridiculous. Next question, please. That, that was all? Madam President! Please! Madam President, 
Public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the Deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. How do you feel about this? Public opinion is one thing, the security of the state is another. These Deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect the American people. Please! Uh, I have worry about Hattie because all the androids were doing all the work Madam President. and people can't leave, live without Madam electric uh, devices. Is it true that the androids could hack our IT systems, like nuclear power plants and military bases? All androids working on sensitive sites have been neutralized and all IT systems have been suspended to avoid any risks of hacking. The situation is under control. Madam President! Madam President! Okay, what should I talk about? Please! Madam President! Jericho assault? What can you tell us about the assault that happened last night? The FBI raided an abandoned freighter in Detroit at 10.45 p.m. yesterday. Several thousand androids were destroyed or captured. Our forces are now combing the streets to ensure that none got through the net. We are going to find them one by one and destroy them. Please! Please? Over here, please? Cyberlife? What's gonna happen to Cyberlife? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any comments about anything I else until we've dealt with the android. Question. I read some Thank you. several that articles about <laughs> President <laughs> and Cyberlife <laughs> kind of close. Oh, Connor is being a spy here. Connor model 313-248-317. I'm expected. Identification successful. Okay. Go ahead. like a missile. It's really tall. Whoa. What well, Amanda knows that I betray does Amanda Follow me. Send we'll escort you. Thanks. Her? But I know where to go. Maybe. But I have my orders. Okay, I think they're suspecting me already. Maybe Amanda sent the data already to Cyberlife. So huge. They display the models.
Agent 54, level 31. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. Uh, how? Neutralize. Uh, oh. What should I do? Oh, I can hack it. Cool. Disable, and what should I do? Oh, I can pre pre-construct like... I thought Marcus could only do that. Super cool. Connor is such savage. Well, killing people is not <laughs> cool, but please indicate your identity and destination. Agent 54, level sub 49. Connor is such savage. savage. God. Access authorized. The skill that he used was <laughs> amazing. Oh, it's Kara. The last boss leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. Okay. 20 minutes, 20 minutes. Talk? Are you alright? I'm, I'm, I'm really cold. Oh, so Alice Model YK500 settings has hot or cold sensitivity. So that's why she felt the temperature. I think Alice likes to uh, be as a human, so I'll just leave it. It would be weird if she doesn't feel anything. Stay close to me. We're going to sneak past them without being noticed. We're going to make it, Alice, I promise you. Don't kill me! I didn't do anything! Shut up, I say! Are there many more? Just eat up there like rats. The more you look, the more you find. Oh, we don't have to spend the night here. There are soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. Come on, get moving. Hurry up, get in. No risk. Is that Luther? Save Luther. Okay, let's go. Hey, 
everybody. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. Oh, they're scanning. <gasps> no, no, please. Oh, you're just killing it. Alice. She's hiding nearby. Kara, you saved us. Oh, we don't know how to thank you. Jer Go before they Jerry? see. Right. Alice. Luther. Aww. I thought you were dead. I was afraid I'd never see you again. I wanted to meet you at the terminal, but they caught me along the way. He's like a really good Come father. On. We're close, but we don't have much time. Hey, we united. Cool. Luther is too huge to hide. Okay, don't, don't stay here. Would you please go away? Oh, gosh. Why are they just killing them? They are just kneeling still. Checkpoint. We have passports, it should be okay, but you never know. Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time, we could miss the bus. Yeah, or it might be safer. Jeez, a really risky, but only three minutes. <laughs> oh, she's sneezing. We only have nine minutes. And if you deter, it said it will take 11 minutes, so we have no choice. We have to go by the checkpoint. We made the fake. I don't like humans who carry guns. They make me nervous. Uh, will you just stay calm? Be quiet. Right, they can hear you. Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. But what if they remember? The you don't realize face. there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out because unless they absolutely look necessary. All similar. Like Where are you going? The same. Always a baby. My it's daughter cute. slept over at a friend's house. We went to pick her up. We're on our way home now. He suspects something. I don't think so. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's cold. She... She's cold. We really have to get her home fast. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around, and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Shouldn't they know the face of all the models? Hey, wait a minute. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. No, 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 no. Don't, Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. No. 
you drop this? Oh, thank you. You're welcome. He was just being friendly. Okay. But if they think Andres are really dangerous and they have to exterminate. We're coming to you live from Detroit where thousands of androids are marching face. through the city at this very How could moment. You not know. The leader of the deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. Alice and Kara and Luther, but I think it doesn't make sense. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. They could recognize face. They all look the same if they are the same model. Here we are, the moment of truth. We don't want confrontation. Easily. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now, or we will open fire. Oh, God. There's no turning back. that you release all androids detained in camps and cease all aggression against us. We are peaceful. Yeah. We will not resort to violence. We are peaceful. We are reasonable. But we are not leaving until our people are free. And if they shoot us, people will take our side. Because it looks too cruel. How should I go? Are you gonna open fire on unarmed protesters? Right. And this is like our symbol. Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out. As long as we can. Oh, Connor. Thousands of androids. Gosh. Hack? Oh, not. Oh my gosh. And 
they look all the same. Maybe it's a new model. Wow. Oh, Connor can convert too? I think Marcus and Connor is the really high version of androids. <laughs> What? Step back, Connor! Connor? And I'll spare him! Sorry, Connor. This bastard's your spitting image. 